What is up everybody, it is Clutch, welcome back to the channel. Today I have a very special video for you guys, we are doing top 10 attachments in Call of Duty Mobile. My list is going to be very different from what other people think and I'm totally fine with that. Go ahead and let me know what you think are the best attachments down below in the comment section. If you like these types of videos, definitely let me know and hit that like button, it really does let me know uh, if you guys are enjoying the content that I'm putting out. And uh, yeah, without further ado, let's jump on in. So there's actually 9 attachments and 3 sites in the Call of Duty mobile game. So I decided to list them all so we have a bonus too. So starting at number 12, we have the holographic site. Now, I don't see the point. I think a red dot's better and it's not zoomed in. So it's kind of bulky feeling. I don't really like it that much. And it's kind of useless in my opinion. But, but moving on to number 11, we have the laser sight. Now the laser sight is kind of useless on every other gun besides shotguns. And no one really uses shotguns, so that's why it's as low as it is on the list. There is a time and place for it, but uh, most people uh, do not use shotguns, like I said before. So moving on to number 10, we have the FMJ. And the FMJ, um, again, it's a certain type of play style. Um, no one really does it, and no one really uses it. It's kind of useless. A stock is better, in my opinion, like if you were going to put it on a sniper, because that's the only thing I could possibly think you would use it on. If you have aimbot, uh, definitely put this on, though. That would definitely help you out. Number nine, we have the long barrel. I personally only use this on SMGs. I uh, would never put this on a sniper rifle or an assault rifle. There are better attachments for those. Uh, but SMGs, definitely a good attachment. And moving on to number eight. The tactical scope is great for uh, assault rifles if you want to get that added uh, zoom and uh, sniper rifles. I personally don't like using it on sniper rifles because it's so overpowered and I think it's just... I think you should be using the scope on a sniper rifle, that's just my opinion. At number 7, this is going to be a surprise to most of you, but the extended mag. And let me explain that it only adds about 8 rounds to assault rifles and about 3 or 2 uh, rounds to sniper rifles. On sniper rifles, I dig it, that's all you really need. But on assault rifles, I don't think it's worth the slot, I think you could put something else on. Like the attachments I have listed above it, like this attachment right here. The stock is an extremely good attachment, it increases your straight speed when you aim, and uh, I did notice that on some guns it does not work as well. I do not know if this is a bug or not, but overall it's still a great attachment and it's definitely become one of my favorites. Number 5, we have the foregrip. Not much to say about this attachment, it's a great addition to any weapon. Number four, we have the red dot sight. This is going to be a surprise to most of you, but if you guys have seen any of the uh, iron sights in the game, or even the other uh, scopes in the game, they kind of suck. So uh, uh, red dot sight definitely goes unnoticed because you just equip it and you're done. You don't really think about it, uh, but uh, definitely deserves to be up high because it is a great attachment. Number three, we have the quick draw. Extremely important attachment, especially if you like to rush in... Uh, play fast like me. Uh, if you're a camper, not so much, but uh, definitely a very important attachment and definitely one of my favorites. Number two, we have the suppressor. Gunfire does not show up on the minimap and the sound is greatly reduced. This is an awesome attachment for any play style and that is why it's number two. Number one, we have the fast mag. I know everybody in the comments is going to say extended mag is better and just trust me, Switch out the extended mag for a fast mag, especially if you like to rush like me. It will be... I'm serious, this is like the best attachment in the game. I love this attachment. I literally put this on every gun that I use and it's never failed me. It's definitely my favorite attachment in the entire game. And I also think it's the best. But that's my top 12, I guess, attachments in Call of Duty Mobile. And I hope you guys did enjoy. Make sure to like, subscribe, share, comment. You guys know the drill. Join the hashtag plus squad. And as always, I will see you guys in the next one. I'm out. Peace.